today we're going to be talking about Apple's event. So I welcome all forms of just uh, Looks snark. like we, we got something going on now. Good morning and welcome back to Apple Park. That was a very big letdown of an opening compared to the other ones. Like there's no soaring drone shots. There's nothing there. I'm disappointed and angry already. <laughs> This isn't the the important event of the year. The September event is usually that the doesn't matter. Event. The other events they did weren't in the like the even the not important ones did some pretty dramatic stuff with the opening. Because who the heck cares about Apple TV? Not me. I don't care. They have some good holdings. Sure, I'm not gonna watch them. I don't care, Tim. Can we can we get on with this? You can't see me right now, but I'm like slowly slumping in my chair. So for those who don't know, we have a bingo card, and I'm just, just crossing off stuff on the bingo card as we go, but nothing's been crossed off yet. You got free. Oh, oh okay, but... Uh, that's new case colors. <laughs> who cares about new case colors? See, this is the flashy transition that I'm talking about when they transition to this, right? That's what I'm talking about. It's something only Apple can do. It's something only we can do. They said that last time and the time before that. So are you? Is really it on the bingo card? At this point, it is not. So they're just talking about the the A15 chip, which we've already had for like the past few years in the iPhone in the iPhone 13. It, it's great for budget devices, but it's not a revolutionary thing. And and they're still putting the whole thing inside of the iPhone 8 chassis. Maybe they were going to talk about, like, the A16 chip, but because of supply chain issues, they backed down and talked about the A14. Yeah, which probably would have been the wise thing to do, because, like, it's a complete travesty right now. Which 5G? They, they're they not going to specify that, what, 5G? <laughs> you know, the one with 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 five of the Gs. The one, the one that has one more G than 4G. That, 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 that 5G. Where I live, we don't even get 5G. <laughs> When you live, you don't even get decent internet. Nope. iPhone SE also has some of our latest camera innovations. Are they going to spend 30 minutes on, on a camera? I hope not. Uh, is, is, is that on the bingo card? No, but it oh. happened last time around. Use our commitment to minimize it. Oh, we got to check the, the box about the environment. We, we are You're really right. happy about saving the planet. Okay, is it worth $30 more than the last generation? Yeah. But here's my issue, right? They never, no one ever talks about this when they ever talk about these things. The oh, the best and most private iPhone you can buy on the market today is the original SE2, because it doesn't have the ability to be found if you offline, like even if your phone's battery dies or whatever. Enables iPad's magical experience. Calling it magical. Wow, if only they could bring a 12 megapixel front camera to their <laughs> to their laptops. You know, the ones that have the same processor in them. Come on, it can't be that hard to put a 4K front facing camera on your uh, on on your laptop. Is it bad that I'm more distracted by the spotlight that she that that's like following her than I am watching what's behind her? They they added USB-C to the air. I love how they like just skate over that. And by the way, we're we're complying with uh, European Union regulations. And maybe I should get high and watch this next time. <laughs> maybe it'll look better. Hey there, kid. You want to smoke some crack? Take a shot every time Tim Cook does the prayer hands. Ah, there we go. I'd be dead. There, yeah, you'd be dead. Look, he did it. He did. It. He just did it. The M1 Super Pro Max Edition Plus. All right, now here's a question for the bingo chart. Does this really qualify for the M1X chip? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll take that for M1X. Uh, here we go, my favorite guy, Johnny Surugi. Did you know that Johnny Surugi wears the same clothes every single day? He wears that exact same, the exact same clothes every single Apple event, and it's the same on his picture on the website. See, look at the one behind. Yeah, they're see, teasing. That? They're teasing us. They're saying, is it is it a pro? Is it a tower? It's literally just taking two M1, uh, M1 pros and gluing them together. Why the heck is there just a mirror like on the table? Uh, because you you have to admire yourself at Apple. So what if we just took two M1 Macs and glued them together? <laughs> oh. 
Oh, up there's the graph. Is a graph. Gotta check off that graph box. All we need is a new MacBook Air and Apple News Plus updates. Can we get to them? <laughs> and we're putting it inside of a MacBook Air. We can also get the new MacBook Pro base model, which probably won't happen. An M2 chip, which probably also won't happen. <laughs> which they're spending a lot of time on this. Maybe they're not going to talk about M2. Yeah, I think they're going to save M2 for later this year. Like during mm. WWDC or something. Which can now run on Mac. There was a cut there. That was definitely a cut. You you could hear the audio skipping. Yeah. See, that, that pretty much all but proves they were going to do it, but they just didn't do it for some reason. I I love how every every picture they have of their pro users is with the uh, the thousand dollar stand. They used a machine learning algorithm to figure out what people want. Oh, cheese grater, cheese, cheese. Oh, it's like a mini pro. <laughs> it's an airport, except, <laughs> and it has a. It literally is just a fat airport. That's kind of funny. No, it's like it's like two pro or two uh two minis put together. Yeah, two mi two minis stacked on top of each other. Larger Mac Mini. Oh yeah, we got that. We didn't get an old iMac reference. So we get that that it's we're really off to the races. So in other words, what Apple did is they looked at they looked at the the Xbox, the the new Xbox, and they were like, oh, yeah, that seems like a good idea, and so they copied it. Oh, oh, did you see that? It had USB-A ports! It had USB-A ports! <laughs> yeah, just A. They nothing about speed, though. Nothing about speed! Uh, is that is that a reference to the old Mac? I think it is. <laughs> old iMac reference? Depends on what that actually means, though. If it is, we might, we might have bingo, because that literally is comparison to old... Old iMacs. Ah. Old iMac reference. May it might may just be bingo. May maybe bingo. Yeah. Hey, bingo! I'm, bingo! I'm still going to fill out Woo! the other ones, though. The word Mac is kind of, like, not becoming a word in my mind anymore. Stop saying Mac, Mac, Mac. Are they gonna do the joke or they're like, look at all this noise suppression, even though it probably doesn't work that hey, way? Hey, uh, they're uh, putting they're putting the high-end oh. camera on their on their their iMac. What a concept. Who Congratulations, Apple, you listen to people. Congratulations. Oh my gosh, they even do the the center stage stuff. Mac 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 Mac. Mac 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 Mac? Mac? Add Mac 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 AirPods Mac Studio. No, she's gonna get sucked in and then she's gonna get blown into the fans and die. <laughs> that's, that's very what... Apple. Yeah, I was right. This is a literal death trap. <laughs> not... <laughs> no, but she won't die because the sp the fans never spin up because it's so good. Is that Nike product placement? I, I love product placement. Wow. I didn't even catch that. <laughs> hey, it's, it's, it's under, it's under 5,000. That is an improvement, but $2,000 for that display. Yeah, I think because we checked off the bingo card, they're just not going to do anything else. I think this is it. We're coming close to the end of the hour. <laughs> I think it's supply chain stuff. There's no, there was an abnormal amount of non-Apple like cuts in this. Oh, that's it. That's yeah, all you get. Get out of here. Get out of here. Tim Apple says scram. We appreciate it very much, Tim Apple. See, look, see, okay, that's a, that's a more acceptable cut, right? This is, this is the kind of cuts that I'm talking about, like, are actually intentional. What, what was that? Production, health, and safety. What, they they have end credits? Yeah, they've had this for since COVID. All right, so what was your favorite part? <laughs> Honestly, I really wanted a new air or talk of like the M2 chips, but my guess is probably they didn't talk about that because of supply chain shortages and they might have not have been able to uh, shore up the fab space for it. I think of the things that they announced, the thing that seems the most 
interesting to me is no probably the air the you have something with the power of the ipad pro except now in a smaller more portable thing that is cheaper and so you could you legitimately could get like a lot of the performance like like a lot of the the the, the uses that you have with pro without having to spend pro prices for something so like if you wanted to if you were doing something with like like I don't know, you wanted to get into Photoshop, and you have you have a Mac, um, and so you wanted to to do like proper photo editing from your your iPad and use it like a tablet. Well, you can do that without having to have a, a super high investment with the iPad Air. Um, the other thing that even though you don't like it, the thing that the I I think that the new display that they have looks interesting. Yes, it is very expensive, but I think I think we just exhausted everything from the event. To be honest, we already yeah, ran, I think we that's already it. ran through it. There's this event is awful. It was disappointing. Unless you planned on wasting your money during before, uh, you're not going to waste your money on it now. Yeah, I'd say tepid. I'd say the event was tepid. It's just okay. Maybe maybe, maybe lukewarm. If you if you're Say lukewarm excited and, about something and in my mind, that's honestly more disappointing than something just being flat out bad. Because I can, as much as I rag on Microsoft for having bad events, when something is bad, I just laugh at it. I can't even. Yeah, it's laugh like at saying this. something is. It's like saying something is mid. The problem with something being mid is if it is exceedingly bad, you can make fun of how bad it is, and you can watch it. And enjoy it because of how bad it is. Or if something's really good, you can watch it because it's really good. But if something's mid, there's just not much that's interesting about it. And you don't even get the payoff of enjoying making fun of it because it isn't quite bad enough to make fun of it. And so it's like the worst category that you could be in is to just be mid. So it's it's better to just... Be, be good <laughs> or bad. Yeah, just be bad. Might just as well be, be like bad. Microsoft. Just make terrible events. Do, do it unashamedly. Anyone. Leave a like on this video so that we can trick the YouTube algorithm into thinking you're making transformative content. <laughs> there we go. Catch you later. Remember, uh, if you like Apple, uh, you are a loser.